Feeling like Mr. Lucky today Things seem to be going my way The reason I've got this big smile on my face I don't get caught up in the whole rat race Unless you've seen Oklahoma City lately, you haven't met this vibrant urban phenomenon or felt its forward momentum, the sense of expectation across this 10-county metropolis. Oklahoma City put its own remarkable resurgence in motion. A series of visionary projects has transformed the landscape, setting the stage for wave after wave of new development. Along with a rising chorus of kudos from other cities, national media, and the NBA, who played here in 2005 and 2006. What set all this in motion? This city's citizens, inspired by good ideas and strong leadership, who approved a sales tax to fund the most ambitious urban revitalization in the country. First, the arrival of one of the best AAA ballparks in the USA and a charming mile-long canal transformed Bricktown into one of the fastest growing entertainment districts anywhere. But it was just the beginning. There's also the remodeled Cox Convention Center and the Ford Center, consistently ranked as one of the nation's top 10 concert venues, and in the eyes of many NBA players, a dream arena. There's a spectacular downtown library, and in the Arts District, a modern, acoustically perfect performing arts center ensconced in an Art Deco jewel. MAP's momentum drew the Oklahoma City Museum of Art downtown. Known for its Dale Chihuly glassworks, its collection is exceptional and it's a festive destination for sophisticated fun. Just south of downtown, maps made the Oklahoma River a seven-mile waterway with 15 miles of trails, 19 pedestrian bridges, and landscaped parks. Regatta Park hosts an elite slate of rowing championships. The sleek new Chesapeake Boathouse is a striking landmark and busy hub for rowers and various fitness programs. Just down the river, a new urban skate park was designed with the help of Matt Hoffman, the world-famous X Games superstar, whose home is still OKC. The downtown renaissance has not only energized the urban core, its momentum radiates outward in every direction, with dynamic growth in retail, restaurants, culture, entertainment, and industry. So, what's it like living here? First, you'll get more for your housing dollar here than most anywhere else in America. You'll also enjoy a lifestyle that's free of many of the frustrations that plague larger cities. These days, clean air, low crime, a low cost of living, abundant water, and free-flowing traffic are pretty persuasive. MSN.com ranks this as the sixth most drivable city in the country, with 24,000 miles of four-lane roads. You can reach almost any location in 20 minutes or less. Add four distinct seasons, abundant year-round sunshine, and equally sunny people, and OKC is tough to beat. There are more non-stop flights from OKC's newly expanded airport than ever, and their numbers are constantly climbing. Plus the fact that more and more business is done virtually has created a new advantage here. Oklahoma is hardly the prairie many people envision. In fact, the EPA certifies that, on a mile-for-mile -mile basis, Oklahoma has the most diverse terrain in America. In the state Time magazine called An Aquatic Paradise, there are five major lakes in the OKC metro area alone, and 50 within 100 miles, all remarkably crowd-free. Extensive trails are a much-loved amenity. So are golf courses, all 36 of them. To make you feel at home, there's a vast array of neighborhoods to consider. Downtown housing is expanding to meet demand for lofts and condos close to the action. The near downtown area offers charming historic neighborhoods, many with views of the downtown skyline or the Capitol Dome. Outward from the central city are leafy suburban towns and cities, many with historic main streets. Surrounding communities are prized for their fine public schools and small town feel. Most have a university or college or two. In fact, the metro area has 18 college and university campuses. It's one of a very few cities with two major state universities, the University of Oklahoma and Oklahoma State. Both are as respected for their academic achievement and research as for their championship sports teams. 
The success of MAPS led to the passage of MAPS for Kids, funding another ambitious transformation, reinventing the 72 schools that serve Oklahoma City's K-12 students, from bricks and mortar to computers. The decade-long process began in 2001 to replace or renovate every school, plus restructure the OKC district from the ground up. It's the nation's only partnership between city and school districts, and a giant leap for this fortunate public education system. Medical excellence is another priceless quality of life component, and Oklahoma City is blessed with an abundance of it. Of course, a city's cultural diversity plays a key role in shaping and educating its citizens of all ages. The Asian district offers evidence of a significant population from many Asian nations. The presence of American Indians in Oklahoma is relatively well known, but tribal nations here are now emerging as major players in the state economy. And soon, an affiliate of the Smithsonian Institution will occupy the banks of the Oklahoma River, the American Indian Cultural Center. Oklahoma City's African American community is known as a cradle of jazz and of America's civil rights movement. Jazz legends like Count Basie and Charlie Christian got their start in downtown's historic Deep Deuce District, once the hub of African American life. And the Latino community may be OKC's fastest growing population, with a vibrant presence in commerce and cultural life. Oklahoma City's cultural amenities include its many museums, art galleries, architecture, and extensive public art. The Paseo District alone has more than 40 working artist studios, plus all the coffee bars, shops, galleries, and events that go with them. Performing arts range from the Philharmonic, Ballet, and Musical Theater to Shakespeare in the Park. Across the metro area, unique and outstanding attractions and recreation make life here even sweeter. For more and more young people, Oklahoma City is a magnet. Where a combination of lifestyle and low cost of living, along with career opportunities, make a compelling case to dig in and stay. They see a city with a soul. Character, not cookie cutter. A community where one person really can make a difference. And the proof is all around us. Which explains why this is a city that works, known for exceptionally collaborative and engaged citizens. Entrepreneurs thrive here. Our boundless skies seem to nurture creative freedom. The live music scene and emerging film programs are just two examples of an increasingly visible creative community. And that creativity infuses many industries, such as this rising biomedical capital, where scientists man the front lines of the fight against Alzheimer's, AIDS, cancer, and other diseases and where cutting-edge therapies are being launched in record numbers at record speed. There is an impressive list of homegrown corporate success stories, including two of North America's top-ranked energy companies and a young, fast-growing independent producer. Dell Incorporated is a recent high-profile corporate arrival. Companies like Dell are drawn here by the lifestyle and a well-educated labor force with a strong work ethic. There's a robust aviation industry here, led by one of the world's top jet engine repair centers, Tinker Air Force Base, and the FAA's National Training Facility. Tinker was voted the number one Air Force Base in the world by families who've moved often and lived in many cities. That's a quick look at the fast-moving phenomenon that is Oklahoma City today. But there's no substitute for seeing it firsthand. That's when you'll see why we count ourselves lucky that this is our city. Make it yours. I'm feeling like Mr. Lucky today. Things seem to be going my way.